Well, making your outdoor living space look great on a budget can be a big challenge, but it is possible. Yeah, stamped concrete is becoming popular, an alternative for many people choosing to help make their home really pop. It mixes, pours, and spreads like plain old concrete. But if you add a little color and decorative pattern, it's hard to tell a stamped concrete patio from one made of more expensive natural materials. If you're looking to add a little decorative flair to the exterior of your home, stamped concrete can be a good alternative to doing stone or slate, for example. As little as $10 per square foot, stamped concrete can be half the cost of laying individual tiles or pavers. But don't trust the job to just any concrete company. It requires, you know, a certain set of stamps and a certain set of tools to apply the color and a, a certain knowledge and, and mindset to do the whole project and really consider it a piece of art when you're done with it. You want to be sure they have experience in actual stamped concrete, not just concrete, because it's a specialized skill and you should expect to see examples of their work. Maybe the best thing about stamped concrete is the wide variety of colors and patterns you can use. The options are endless, so when it comes to picking, uh, it's, it's best if a customer can kind of get online, take a look around, see what they like, see what's going to match their house or match the setting, um, and then from there we kind of guide them through the process. If you already have a stamped concrete driveway or patio, you can dress it up with what's called an overlay. They too look great, but can be hard to maintain in northern climates. Overlays kind of have their disadvantages there with moisture getting between the overlay and the subsurface. And when it freezes, it expands and, and it has the potential to pop that overlay off. And she says sealing the concrete every two years or so can keep it looking great for at least 10 to 20 years. It's best to use the same sealer each time, so ask your contractor what he or she used on the original job.